to New York to collaborating with the likes of Dixie Chicks and Beyonce. Not that we want to name drop, but come yeah. on, it's pretty good, right? Too Many Zoos <laughs> bringing their Zen Arcade tour to the TAF tonight. But first, we're talking to the band who's managed to smash together. How about jazz, Afro-Cuban rhythms, funk, and house music to create something dubbed Brass House. Leah, how you doing this morning? It's good to see you. I'm doing wonderful. That, 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 that's quite a mashup of, of, of different kinds of music. Talk about how you guys play and what you play. Yeah, our style was created in the subway, and we kind of played whatever the people of New York City liked. Yeah. And because New York City is such a melting pot, there's so many different cultures and different types of people yeah. that we were kind of trying to play for all of them. And um, the more different styles we played, the more different crowds we got. And uh, it really worked for us. And that's, cool. that's kind of how we developed our thing. Yeah. Now, how'd you find each other? Um, well, I met the King of Sludge actually in the subway. We met <laughs> in the subway. Okay. That's and awesome. that's how it worked out. I met um, Matt Doe, the trump player, at Manhattan School of Music, where okay. um, I studied jazz. Yeah. And it kind of just happened. All right. All right. Can I, you make it kind of happen for us this morning? Oh, oh yeah, bit? absolutely. Hold a killer for us. All right, do it. Yep. Thank <laughs> you. 